Hey guys, it's Nikki and welcome to my channel. Welcome to Decorate With Me Christmas Edition Part 2. I will leave Part 1 linked above as well in the description just in case you miss it. But today we are going to be decorating our dining room and our sitting area. I'm not really sure what to call this room, but this is where our big Christmas tree will go. There it is in the little box right there. It is the Christmas tree that I had growing up. It was my parents' old one. They gifted it to Jackson and I, and I am so happy every year when I get to set it back up, put all of our ornaments on it. I love having it because it is just brings so much light to this room, and we have big windows right here in front, and you can see it so well through the windows into our neighborhood. It brings me a lot of joy. But hopefully we'll get this room completed today as well as our dining room and this little nook area possibly. This chair normally goes in <laughs> this corner. However, we obviously had to move that because that's where our Christmas tree is going. This corner, our bar cart normally is in and I'm not sure where that is going to live during the Christmas season, so we're just gonna figure that out as we go. Awesome, let's get started. I love setting up this little corner in our house. It is just so joyful and I love how the lights reflect out into our big window. It is just so pretty at night.
Yay, the tree is up. So I will string lights on that garland. Um, I bought that garland when we moved in. It was like $13 only from Walmart. It isn't the best quality now that I've gotten pre-lit garland from Lowe's. That quality is way better. It's like $20, $25, totally worth the price. Um, I'll string lights on there so everything is nice and sparkly. I love having our mirror in the back there. It really like reflects the light really well. I got that mirror for Christmas last year, so this will be the first Christmas that that is up. But <gasps> yay, the tree is up, I'm so happy. Once I finally got the angel on the top of our tree, that's always the hardest part for me. I always want to make sure she's nice and straight. I went over to the kitchen to start getting our Christmas dishes out. I know this is like so random, it has nothing to do with that main area. However, we have spowed Christmas dishes that I switch out and I really needed to get them in the dishwasher. So I just take our old dishes and put them in this tub where our Christmas dishes were and then I will switch them out at the end of the season. I love finding Spo dishes at TJ Maxx and Home Goods. I've never bought them. I'm not even sure if they're like still in the stores actually. I'm sure they are, but I I've never paid full price. Just go to TJ Maxx and Home Goods.
we are on day two and I am just about to put all of our ornaments on that tree. I keep them organized in this little ornament storage box. The box does allow you to do like layers of ornaments so they're not touching. However, I don't do that. I just want all of them to fit into one box and so I just wrap them nicely and set them in there together. But I'll leave one like mine down below. I got mine a couple years ago, but they're pretty popular all over the place. So I'll leave a couple linked down below for you. Growing up, I received an ornament from my grandparents every single year. So I have 29, well 28, I haven't received this year's yet. And I love getting ornaments when we go to new places. So when we went to Magnolia Market, I got some new ornaments, um, Disney ornaments, obviously. When we went to Breckenridge, I have one. My parents got me one when they went to Alaska. So I just really love this tree because it is just filled with memories from my childhood and all of our adventures. So I guess I did put them um, in like different levels. So I have these and then there's a next level and these are the cardboard things that you can use to separate everything out.
Here's a final look at our dining room and our living room decorated for Christmas. I bought this tear tray a probably at the beginning of this year and I love decorating it it's the first time I get to decorate it for the holidays and I loved how it turned out and I want it all from the lights to the tell me one thing is there anything that you're missing I will keep you warm as soon as you remove that snow whatever we do we will be all right these holiday wonders will open your mind may all your wishes tonight come true the love i live the dream i knew this christmas i only want to be close to you It's a magical time full of kisses. Take a walk outside. Alright, you guys, that's gonna be it for today's decorate with me part two. Thank you so much for watching today's video. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel. Give this video a big thumbs up. Pretty soon here you're just gonna see a quick overview of our powder bathroom. I remembered I didn't add it in part one, so I wanted to show you here. But I hope you guys have a great rest of your day, and I will see you real soon. Bye!